Hello everyone, hope you're all doing well. Last night I was playing as the new killer Dredge for the first time, and my god is he unsettling. But I actually thought he was a lot of fun to play, and while I wasn't using like the best perks or anything in the world, uh, I did think that his ability um, and all the sort of powers he has, I thought they were all really fun to use and utilize and learn and get the hang of. Most of my games that I played, however, were very stressful. The teams I was going against were very, very good, very efficient, very good at looping. A lot of them seemed like they already sort of learned how to deal with his anti-loop and stuff like that. But the gens were going really fast. Most of the time, I would get one hook, and by the time I got my first hook, two gens would be done. Yeah, good start, dude. What are three gens about to pop right fucking now? Damn, this is rough, dude. All right. <laughs> now the two gens are done, we got the down. I even had a match where all five gens were done in four minutes from when the match started. 8.24. Bro, it was a four minute game. The game started and the gens were done in four minutes and three seconds. So yeah, just very good, very efficient teams. Now this did, this does stress me out sometimes when I play killer and it might, you know, make me a little annoyed or frustrated or put me in a little bit of a sour mood. Um, but you know, I never take that frustration out on the other player outside of the match. I don't message anybody. I don't tell them that they did anything wrong. In fact, I actually still continue to compliment the other players even while I'm frustrated. Yeah, that was a tough match. Those are good survivors. Damn. These teams are really good tonight. I think that's a big misconception with people who have watched my videos is that they think that I have this uh, idea that you're not allowed to be upset at the outcome of the game or with what happens in the game i think that's ridiculous i think anybody can be annoyed or upset what i think is silly is when you then when you take it to the next level and message somebody and and you know complain at them yell at them for how they played you know i, I don't think it's that serious but so there were some games where i did tunnel some survivors out of the game uh, to get you know an early kill or a tactical advantage and there were a couple survivors who were not very pleased with me doing this and so they came into my chat to uh let me know big surprise so i'll let you go ahead and watch both of these matches do keep in mind that the first match was only my second time playing him and then the next one is maybe my seventh or eighth time playing him so very fresh i uh, still trying to figure out how to play him, still figuring out how his perks work and all that. But yeah, was I horribly in the wrong for tunneling? Should killers be able to play tactically like this uh, just as survivors try to finish the game in four minutes and get out? Uh, I'll let you guys discuss that in the comments. Enjoy. Again, I've only played one game. I've played against him twice. Okay, my ruins back here. That's actually pretty solid. Oh, I actually came out by somebody. Wait. But I heard somebody's. Okay. It's a really good skin. Yeah, I do like the skin. Discordance is going to be really useful for that. Diagonally. All right, Dwight, where are you going to go? You're going to go upstairs. You're going to stay down here. Fortunately, he's out of the range of where the pallet would be broken if he slides it. Ah! Nice, we barely beat him there. That's going to be very nice for me. Okay, let's see if there's any scourge hooks. I don't believe I have a scourge hook here. I don't, so we'll just put him in the basement. How do we like the new killer? This is only my second match with him, so. Uh, I guess we'll go over here. If I smack him here, he vaults over it. Oh, that didn't count for for the slide. I guess I have to hit him before he vaults it. Yeah, fair enough. That sucks. Am I in range here? Does this break? Wait, fuck. Hey. 
That's what I wanted, baby. Does it make that noise when I'm out of my t teleport, or does it make that right before nightfall is about to happen? Dude, a lot of survivors are using BT lately, dude. Is he going up, or is he going... Yeah, he is. Not falling for it. His power is really nice in Nightfall. I heard somebody. I just hear breathing. I think I'm hearing. Oh, I thought they were gonna cap the pallet. Where'd she go? I don't even know where she went. That's nice. If he slides this as a break as well. That gen will get done as well. We just use the Mori. Damn. A lot of stabs. Dude gave up, yeah. Yeah, dude, these guys are... I had to get him out of the game because they're just doing gens too fast. That's really nice for me. How did that dude it fucking auto aimed and cr like okay dude. That sucks. That blows, dude. I could have got a free hit there, but it fucking once she turned to run, it like auto aimed my fucking hit away. That sucked. You're trash for tunneling for the Mori? I didn't tunnel for the Mori. That's not why I tunneled. I tunneled to get- oh damn, I was... I tunneled to get a kill, because you guys- I don't know if you're in the match, but they did- they're doing gens really fast, I don't know if you can see that, there's one gen left. I don't know if you can see how many gens are left in the match. But yeah, that's why I tunnel. Look at that, they're gonna finish that gen as well. She's baiting, she's just a fucking baitster, dude. Uh, she'll probably have dead arm. Maybe not. I gotta hope I get a scourge hook in time. Hey, would it be silly of me to ask you to not do gens very fast? Would that be really silly of me to ask you guys to, to just calm down on gens? Wouldn't that be really silly of me? Sorry, you guys. I saw you don't like the result, but I mean, doing gens is the point of the game. Oh, and getting kills is not the point of the game, right? I love that argument, dude. So your your objective is to do gens. What's my objective? To let you to let you go? Is that is that my objective? You get to play the objective card, right? I don't get to play that though. When it's the killer, I have to- I have to take it easy on you. Fair enough, man. Not tunnel like an ass? Dude, the logic is- the logic is just not there, dude. So tunneling to get a kill faster is playing like an ass, but doing gens very fast doesn't make you an ass. You're doing your objective fast, I'm doing my objective fast. 
We're both an ass in that scenario. Again, it wasn't for the Mori. I, I was going to put you on a Scourge Shook. I only Moried you because I couldn't make it to a Scourge Shook. I just wanted you out of the game so I could get uh, a kill. Lol, okay. That's a good argument. Yeah, when you don't have anything else to say, just say okay. Yeah, if anybody if anybody in chat's rude, they're just going to delete your message. We're not we're not trying to be, uh, be rude, you know? No need to stoop to their level. This is such an interesting map. This is definitely the most, like, different map of all of them. Of course not, I wish I had my pallet out on. Maybe we'll get ruin value though. So he knows what to do, he can just hold forward. I mean his anti-loop's not that, that great. Still get him pretty quick. Lost him in the dark, couldn't see. There we go. My scourge right below me. There we go. Yeah, his anti loop seems pretty easy to counter. You just fucking run. I'm gonna get rid of all the pallets that were dropped over again. Definitely bite me in the ass later. Two gens done. I'm gonna tunnel the bill. Sorry, man. Two gens done, two people on a gen. Gotta do what I gotta do, brother. Map is already out? Yeah, I came with Dredge. Right. We'll try to get him out. Sorry, buddy. Uh. Poor Bill. Dude, it's a bummer, but like... My games have been so quick lately, I just... I need... I need to... Why do they have to bark? You silly dogs, please. You silly dogs. Now, I'm not gonna tunnel now, because I don't need to. So now I'm not worried. Unless, like, it gets down to the wire later, then maybe, but... Yeah, that's a god palette.
make a good play, but it gets negated. Behind it hard. Jesus. That fucking dude, the 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 base speed is wild, dude. It's so slow. My ruin is carrying me this game, I love it. Oh my god, hello. Oh, I actually made the right play and then I fucked it up. Nice. I actually made the right play and then I just hesitated. Feels good. Wow, this knee is living in my head rent free, dude. Not anymore. There you go. Well played, dude. She was making all the right reads. <clears throat> Ruin do be underrated? No, I don't think it's underrated. I think it's just RNG dependent. They haven't cleansed it yet, therefore I'm getting value. The getting that bill out has made this such a chill game. I'm enjoying the dredge. <sighs> Been having some really uh, good survivors tonight. I thought maybe, just maybe. He had live as well. Him and the bill. He's fun though. Why does it say don't be an asshole, but you play like one? Why it was necessary to tunnel me out? Didn't even have dead heart either. Um, I tunneled you out because I've been having uh, very fast games as killer. Very good teams I've been going against. And I wanted to have a game that was not super stressful. Because I'm trying to learn the killer's uh, ability. And it's very hard to learn the killer's ability when I'm getting insanely good teams and I'm getting like five minute games. So I tunneled you so that I would have an e easier match. Survivors have not had any regard for my fun, which is perfectly fine. I don't think they should. You know, they've, they've been worrying about themselves and worrying about escaping, which is perfectly valid. And so I'm just doing the same thing as killer, you know? I'm just focusing on my fun and my, uh, my experience. Because that's what the survivors do, you know? Nice dead hard. I don't know why I didn't wait it out. Bro, this girl is really in my head. Oh my god, man. She made that all the way to another pallet as well. Holy fuck. It's, uh, you're gonna be fine. And chat, be nice. Um, chat, if you're rude, you're gonna get banned, timed out. Well, look, when I, when I have multiple games where I'm just like, I get one hook and two gens are done and the gens just go, 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 like, you know what I mean? It's, it's really, it's difficult matches. Like, I, get, I had a four minute match earlier. Five gens done in four minutes. It's really difficult sometimes. And uh, yeah, I just these past couple games, I've wanted to chill more of a chill match. So if tunneling gives me a chill match, I'm going to do it, you know? Same reason survivors play the way they do to have fun. <clears throat> I like losing my voice. Hey, there goes Ruin. Nice. Wasn't anything against you. It was just... Uh, wanted to get you out. But you really slow down during this. Go. Uh, 
People just need to relax, yeah. Well, that's just another example right there of people comparing the game to real life, you know? So, like, in my chat, or my, in my rules, it says don't be an asshole to people. Because I'm talking about in real life, like in reality. People will read that and they'll go, wow, you say don't be an asshole, but then you're going to tunnel in Dead by Daylight? Like, well, I'm not really talking about a playstyle in a game. I'm talking about reality. I'm talking about real life. Don't be an asshole. Not, not the fictional video game. I don't care about being an asshole inside the fictional video game. That's not in my chat rules. But I prefer people weren't assholes to each other in reality in my chat. That's that's the point of the rule. What's crazy is despite all the rough matches I've had, even even survivors teabagging and clicking flashlights, never did I message anybody. Never did I disconnect or take any frustration out on the other players. Despite me like having rough matches, being stressed out a little bit, you know what I mean? Like not having a good time. Never did I message any of them.